Welcome to the aeration tutorial. In the first exercise, you are asked to calculate the saturation and concentration of oxygen. And what you need for this exercise is Henry's law. And Henry's law states the following saturation concentration equals the KD value times CG. And if you have a look at the formula sheet, the CG value can be found as the following. So KD is the same, and then the CG value is PA divided by R times T. And this will give you the answer in mole per cube. So if we fill in, we need to find a couple uh, values. First of all, the KD value. This can be found on the formula sheet. So it's for oxygen at 10 degrees Celsius. And this value is 0 0.041. And then we need the PA value. And that's the percentage of oxygen in the air at 10 degrees Celsius times the atmospheric pressure. Uh, again, if you have a look at the formula sheet, this volume percentage of oxygen in air is 20.948%. So this can be written as 21% since it's nearly 21%. And we have to multiply this by the atmospheric pressure, which is 101,325 Pascal. And this all has to be divided by R times T. R is a value that can be found on the formula sheet, which is 8.31 Joule per mole times Kelvin. And T is the temperature in Kelvin, so it's 10 degrees Celsius which is 283 Kelvin. All of this leaves us with a result of 0 0.37 mole per cube. However, we want the answer in milligram per liters. So what you need to do is you need to multiply it by the molar weight of oxygen. So again, CS equals 0 0.37 mole per cube, multiplying by the mo uh, molar weight, molar weight is 32 grams per mole, since we have an O2 molecule it's 2 times 16, and this gives us 11.9 gram per cube, which is equal to 11.9 milligram per liter.